Hi everyone, this is Sanjay Thakur. Today we are doing a recipe with sukari dates and uh, it's a very, uh, I would say, an intense recipe. It's basically short ribs and dates. Dates gonna show its impeccable flavor in four different formats. The first format, definitely it's with paste uh, short ribs. Uh, second format will be in a croquette form. Uh, third format will be in a twill form. Fourth format will be in a crispy shard form. And in fact, the jus is also uh, being infused with these lovely dates. Uh, so stay tuned. So we're gonna start off with our mise en place for braising our short ribs, where we have onions, tomato, garlic, carrots, celery, some chili, and not to forget sukari dates, remove the seeds, and we're gonna keep them ready. Marinating our short ribs with salt, pepper, onion powder, olive oil, just nicely on both sides, a little bit of sweet paprika, and our date syrup. Let it rest for minimum six hours. In a pot, take equal amount of olive oil and butter, some garlic, dates so curry dates uh, some chili and uh, flavor the fat with these beautiful aromas then sear our meat off our short ribs off on both sides nicely transfer the short ribs on a tray on the same pot start with some herbs some more butter onions celery carrot and tomatoes in Deglaze the pan with non-alcoholic wine. Now top these all lovely vegetables up on top of your short ribs. Some more herbs and some spices, bay leaf, fennel seeds, coriander and black pepper. I'm gonna add some tomato paste to it and right after that some brown chicken stock to top it up. Cover it properly and seal it and top it up with a tray. Bake it for 3 hours at 175. Right when your meat is ready, open it very carefully, it will be super hot. Remove the bone from the meat, strain the liquid and reduce the liquid by 80% for the sauce. Shed the meat of the bone and keep the rest for later use. For herb oil, we're going to take some parsley, remove the stem and then blend it with the neutral oil. Next, we're gonna start with date and potato shard. We slice some onions, add it to some butter, make it caramelize, and after they have light golden color, we blend it together with milk. Add some dates from the same braising liquid and blend it properly. We rough cut the potatoes and keep them from boiling until soft. And once they are soft, we add it to the liquid with the caramelized onions. Now we're gonna make it into three colors. One can be with the turmeric, one can be with the paprika and one can be with any sort of herb oil so be creative with it we're gonna lay them flat on the sheet and then bake it in the oven for 140 for about eight minutes we're gonna peel them off from the mat fry them off at 160 for about 30 seconds for the short ribs we're gonna take up uh, shredded short ribs and the dates from the braising liquid mix them evenly and after mixing them evenly, we're gonna add some seasoning to it and an egg white. Form a rollout and let it rest in your fridge for six hours. Portion your short ribs in desired shape. Coat the short ribs evenly on all sides from the previously made reduction. Heat the short ribs under the salamander before service. Use the same gar as from the braising liquid, which was left aside to form a puree. For date and short ribs twill, Form a smooth paste using flour, egg white and date short rib mix. Preferred silicone mat and bake this mixture at 120 for 4 minutes. For the croquet, we take chopped garlic and onion and saute them off. For the short ribs, we follow the same procedure. Short ribs and some dates chopped together. On the other pot, we take some butter and flour and we cook them lightly on a low heat. Keep adding milk slowly as per requirement and once we have a nice consistency we add our chop onion and garlic mix and the short ribs with dates together. Mix it nicely and let the mixture rest. Once the mixture has rested we form uniform shapes for the mixture and dip it 
and flour, then egg wash and then breadcrumbs and we fry them on a medium to high heat until golden brown. Last component is asparagus. We cut them in desired shape and blanch them off. Season it accordingly. And for the plating, we're gonna bring our short ribs, which have been heated under salamander. We're gonna put some carrot cream next to it. We're gonna put our croquette on the other side of the plate, top it up with some more carrot cream. We're gonna put some asparagus on top, and then we're gonna have our shards placed right on top of it. And then our twill, which we have prepared, gonna go on top of the croquette. Microgreens, and we have some jus which has been prepared as a reduction of the same stock or the braising liquid. Put some herb oil around the plate. So here's my dish with the philosophy of minimal wastage and bringing out the beauty or the essence of Sukaria dates in different formats or textures. Hope you enjoyed it. Do 